if Padre's not hopping up in here, I'm going to go ahead and record this. So Padre's not present. Um, I'm recording now, by the way. Padre's not present. Oh, okay. And uh, so Dave and I found this game while surfing on Itch.io called Old Man. It's by A Normal Mate. And it's a parody fan game of Tunky by Dave Microwaves Games. And he said PS, well, PD. I love Dave Microwaves Games. Padre Snow Mizzle. Nobody mentions poor, Padre. That's crazy. Yeah, poor starving artist never gets credit. I know. <laughs> and myself, <laughs> which is pretty pretty flattering because I like just started making games. But yeah, mm-hmm. they, they mentioned Padre, so you know we got to play it. So that's what this is. We play. That's the only reason why we're playing. That's it. why we're playing. They mentioned Padre. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully it doesn't uh, fuck up on me. Dave was trying to play it before, and it was like, yeah, it was sputtering. Yeah, it was like yeah. lagging out really bad. Let me start screen sharing this. Boop. All right, so I don't know if this is stock or not because I'm not. I don't use stock shit. Mm-hmm. But this sounds pretty good. It's probably stock though. I know the uh, walking and door opening sounds were uh, the stock, you know, sounds I use for Tunky as well. Mm-hmm. I hope all my audio is like around the same. Uh... Okay, it's running pretty good. Yeah. I mean, it was like this at first when I went to the living room is when it started like um, stuttering and freezing up. Okay, right, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So, this um... This is the, uh... Hmm? I like it. It feels good. Yeah. I was gonna say, uh, this is the unofficial DLC to Tunky. Yeah. <laughs> unofficial <laughs> fan-made DLC. Ooh. That's See, a nice I like, looking I, room. Yeah, I like this kind of atmosphere. I wish all the other rooms were kind of filled a little bit, though. Like, I could see, like, some shelves or some shit. Yeah. Oh, damn. Ooh. <clears throat> Ooh. What's this? Oh, just fire. That's cool, though. Jiggly. Yeah, it's like jiggly fire. I like this, dude. I really like the aesthetic of this. Mm-hmm. Like, it's, like, ob- like I can I can see. Are there two of them? Oh, that's, oh, that's straight tunky up tunky sound. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, dude, I kind of like it. Like, I like that ladder, too. I wonder mm-hmm. if he made all these. Probably. Yeah, probably. It looks good. Like, I like the little imperfections and, like, the... Like the lumpy... Uh, the lumpy couches. stuff, yeah. Yeah, that way yeah, they look flat and perfect, yeah. This is bad. And look at this piano. <laughs> you can walk on <laughs> it, but who cares? Okay, anyway. Wait, you hear that? Yeah, there's a lot of walking. Oh, yeah. This place must not be that big. But yeah, I don't know, man. Like, oh, wait, shit. is he in here? Yeah, oh, he's yeah, in he's here. in here. What is he doing? He's hunting for me. Good thing I went in here. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Hi. Uh, Goodbye. Okay. Cool. Anyway, but yeah, I feel Whoa, like he could add like. Flashlight feels really bright now. Yeah, for some reason, I don't know. Anyway, I feel like he could add like this kind of stuff, like in the hallway, maybe. Mhm. Like little know, like, drawers, paintings, little yeah, paintings uh, and stuff. stuff. Yeah. What's that? Is that just part of the? I think it's like just holding up the shelf. All right. But yeah, anyway, like I was saying, like I know the style is supposed to be emulating yours, mm-hmm. but it feels kind of unique at the same time. Yeah, it feels different enough where it doesn't feel like it's cloning or anything. Yeah. Shit. Oh, he coming. I can't fucking see shit. I don't know. I'm taking it really <laughs> slow because I'm analyzing it. Like I'm trying to... Yeah. I don't... Yeah. <laughs> this flashlight is kind of super bright. Are there two? There might be. Watch out, Jumbo. Oh, is this the laggy room? Oh, uh, no, it was the uh, living room. Oh, wait, no, it is this room. I think so, anyway. Kind of looked like it. Ooh, kitchen. Ooh. Yeah, it's running pretty well for me. Yeah. I guess the problem my end, most likely, I was doing that shit. Can you open the fridge? I need to make a fridge. Like, there's this thing going around on Twitter called the Fridge Crew. They're like a bunch of indie what? developers are like, when they make a fridge, they're like, or a fridge, a fridge, they're like, Fridge Crew. 
I don't know. I'm fucking weird. <laughs> I haven't made Never a fridge heard yet. Of that. You haven't? Oh, damn. We outside. Uh, okay. What's out here? I don't know. I can't close the door back, though. Is it just like... Oh, wow. Okay. Look how bright that is. Oh, that's, that's a bright-ass key. I got the silver key. He just didn't want you to miss it. That's all. Yeah. That's way better than mine. Mine are so obscure. Like... <laughs> Like Here's a game dev tip, though, that I learned, uh, because you started showing me about missing materials. Um, yeah. instead of using point lights... Oh, oh shit. shit. I was gonna say, instead of using point lights, uh, missing materials are pretty nice. Pretty much makes the item glow, so they haven't used a point light. Can you not close the door? Uh, no, I can't. I don't think so. No, I can't. But I lost him, so Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, missing materials are a godsend compared Emissive. to using uh, point lights, yeah. Yeah, that's super easy to do, too. Like, it's, um, literally, like, in the material blueprint, there should be a slot for emissive. You just, uh, drag off of that and then do multiplication. Like, do a multiply by, like, one by one or however bright you want it to be. Mm hmm And it, that's basically it. It's pretty easy. All right, so that was the key. Now I need to find like a bear or bear trap. Wow, a board or a whoa, what the hell? Requires key. I can straight up open it though, but I guess I gotta find a key still. This is pretty cool though. Like this, there's a lot of steps involved, I guess. Like, so far, I mean, Tunky had a lot of steps, like freaking getting a. Bolt, like a bolt cutter from that one locked closet or whatever you need the crowbar to oh, open yeah. the closet yeah you're right i think back then when i was making tunky um requires a hammer oh my god i don't i think back when i was making oh, tunky dude. it was a wire cutter that was in that room instead of a crowbar so it was really quick to beat like i just uh padded out the gameplay and added that closet another thing i'd like to point out is he has toggle crouch which is not mm -hmm. default or it's not the easy way out, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, so like he put a little extra work to make it toggle instead of just straight up press crouch and then unpress it. Because you could do like a flip flop and just make it super easy. Oh shit, okay. You just walk into it and there's the yeah. bolt cutters. Bolt cutters. Yeah, there you go. I can use that over, oh shit. Ooh, he's coming. Oh, he coming. I, I think it's just the one. Yeah. I think he's just... He's got that feeling that he's everywhere. So if this gets if this gets me out, this this room has a light in it. So that's the yeah okay. So if this gets me out, oh god, spook. Don't kill me, please don't 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 don't. Oh damn. Okay. I see how it is. I mean, the and, silver key was pretty quick to get. Yeah. Okay. So um. Let's go back to the outside. Yeah. So his uh. Oh my god. I think he like checks this corner. <laughs> He's got a big ass point light. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh, what the hell? I'm not in did. here! No. <laughs> <laughs> There's no, like, getting away from him. Like, he chases you for so long, you gotta literally just, like, lose his ass. It's mm -hmm. the only way. You can't hide from him once he sees you. It's pre I, I kinda like that, though. Cause then it's yeah. like, you can just cheese it. Like you can in, um, Shopping Nightmare 2. Or could. Yeah. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> Just keep running, I think. I'm just gonna option. not. Yeah, I'm just gonna not go that way anymore. Have I been in here? There before? you go, you lost. Awesome. Bolt cutters to oh. get in here. Okay. I will remember that. <laughs> I love how you can still open the doors. Oh, what the hell? A hammer. Oh, hammer. Nice. Wait. Okay, so he just has it this set. It's kind of sad how his hammer model looks more detailed than mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that door thing. I don't know. It's just... Oh, whatever. Fuck it. We'll move past it. 
It's fine. Hmm. Yeah, that's yeah. actually something I need to do is like uh, do a complete like revamp of all my uh. Oh, I it's guess, a like, granny thing. Oh shit. That's cool. Yeah, I gotta like, go back and uh, friggin' so completely revamp like a lot of my reusable assets, like the hammers and shit, just so I can make them look nicer. Cause like, I'm still using the ones back when I made like Tunky and oh yeah, all those old games. Yeah, yeah. I use all like, mine I haven't too. updated it. Like all my shit's the same. I wonder if there's anything even in these drawers. Oh wow, that was a strong ass hammer. Door, right? Holy shit. <laughs> Got a crowbar. I don't think I have to interact with any of this. I think it's all hit boxes. You just walk into it. Oh, you're right, yeah. Silver key. Oh, so it is random. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Well, the gold... Yeah, the silver key was outside. Oh, damn. Dude, this is a good game. Yeah, like, I this is, lie. This is not bad. <laughs> the, the gameplay is great. Hell yeah, man. Let's see if there's anything outside again. Like, there's little nitpicks and stuff, like how you can still see the shadow of the flashlight. Mm -hmm. Or how you can see, see how you can see the flashlight shadow. Yeah. But other than that, like it's just, the only reason I'm noticing those now is because I'm I actually work on games. Otherwise, like if I was still just a let's player, then fucking I wouldn't notice that shit. God damn it! Just keep running. Just gotta be careful not to go into any of these rooms. The loop. <laughs> it's got a long ass delay. Uh, I don't have the gold key. Yet. <laughs> oh, so he has a golden key. I keep forgetting. Like I, I'm so used to just clicking doors. Nice. Oh, okay. Oh. So then, so there's what? alternate shit. Like there's like an alternate oh, ending. Oh, so yeah. So I think what the deal is that like certain items can spawn in certain places, which can either I guess make the game longer or shorter. I'd imagine. <clears throat> I don't know. I kind of want to see what's behind that granny room, because there was a button behind the bolt cutter's room. Mm-hmm. Is he coming back? Of course. Yeah, yeah. Just, yeah, just uh, get out of there. I need to stop going that way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I didn't test my audio before I started this. Seems oh, like you didn't? Was... Yeah. Can you the bolt cutters again? <laughs> Okay, I need to come back here for that. Anyway, I, I didn't test my audio before I did this, so I don't know how loud this is compared to our voices. Yeah. Christ, he's up my ass, dude. Wait, you just closed that door. <laughs> yeah, it, it lets me close some of them. Dude, he's so relentless. This old man. I feel like... I think it's cool that he made it a parody game. But yeah. it, dude, it's, it, it could totally make it on its own without being a parody game. Mm -hmm. Oh, and the little, like the ground, like the little step thingies. I feel like that's straight up just to avoid Z fighting. Like he does the same thing with the wall. Oh yeah, places. true. Yeah. Which it, it could work. If maybe there were different textures on the floors, it would look a lot better when you if you did that. Like you know how sometimes part of the house has like carpet and part of it has like wood. Yeah. And some people's hat. He could do like that. Okay, I feel like nothing yeah, is in here until you press the button. Yeah. It's so scary. Or maybe something can't spawn in there, and that's what the button would be for. The access spot. Um, maybe. That makes sense. Yeah, I think there's like two different light roots have i been in here yeah yeah you've been here that's where you got the silver key it's back here clickety clock clickety clickety clack oh shit Ooh. 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 all right so i gotta get those bolt cutters Watch out for Jumbo, he might be around here. Yeah, shit, he coming. Yeah, it's him. Where the hell? Whatever, I'm going in here. Oh, nice. Gold key. Oh, nice. Okay. 
I don't know where he is. I can hear him though. Actually, I think he's wrapping. He's going around the other way. Yeah. So now's my chance to see if there's anything in here. Oh shit. No, he's coming this way. Oh yeah. I can hear him. Oh shit, he's coming in here. Hey buddy. Oh lanky look. What? What the hell? He saw you through the crack. Oh man. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. I'm not taking a right this time. I'm going left this time. Good god, man. That sucks. Oh my god, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're gonna get dicked in here. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I don't know how his pawn sensing is. Dude, I don't, I don't know, but... Yeah. Yeah, he should be fine. Yeah, there you go. Okay, this is a different route. Need a hammer. I need a hammer for that. Is, is he, like, hammer? busting down that door with a hammer, like it's a sledgehammer? Like, holy shit. <laughs> Crowbar. Okay, okay, okay. This is the granny room. Yep. Yeah, you need the uh, button. I still kind of want to. Oh my god, this oh, guy! Fuck. His pawn sensing is so far too. Yeah. He sees you from like all the way down the hallway. Maybe he's using like the default five thousand uh, pawn sensing. Yeah, I've never seen anything in that granny room. Like, I don't know. I think the crazy thing about old man is. Mm -hmm. Is his uh his patrol routes? Cause he'll act like he's going around in one big loop, but he doesn't actually circle the whole loop. Sometimes, sometimes he'll U-turn. Maybe he like stops and way and reverses. Yeah. Okay, I don't see anything out here. Yeah, this is crazy. It's pretty intense. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. That bitch coming. Oh shit, I knew it. I was I was assuming that shit was gonna happen, I knew it. What I'd imagine, right, is that I guess once he takes that curve you go out there and just gets that um gold I'm block. Sitting, I'm sitting right here so he can't see my ass. I just wanted yeah. to get a good look at him, but Okay. So which way was the? I think it was going down the hall. Let's see if there's anything in here? I don't think so. He's coming back. Yeah, I hear him. I'll just keep looking. I don't even remember what items I have. Oh, uh, I had the gold key, I believe, and uh, the crowbar, I guess. Oh yeah. Damn, I don't have shit this run. Oh yeah, the crowbar and the gold key, because I got the hammer earlier. Yeah. I'm scared. I like how your field oh, nice. of vision is just absolute shit. Okay, bolt cutters. We gotta find that bolt cutter room now. This house is a lot bigger than it seems to. Like it's not one big it's not just one big loop. Okay, I don't wanna go out. I don't wanna leave yet. Oh wait, it said you need a silver key, I think, because I saw a silver lock. Yeah, I'm going in here first though. Yeah. Oh there you go. Nice. Silver key, okay. Uh gate room. Is that really Wait, hold on. What was the crowbar for to open that metal locker? No. Crowbar is to get the boards off the the door. Isn't that the hammer? Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. The hammer was for that door. Okay. All right, so I opened the gate room, I think. It didn't make a noise, but I walked into it. Mm hmm So we see what's in the gate room. Hopefully he doesn't peepaw around this fucking corner. All right, here it goes. What's the mystery behind this gate? I don't know, but it's it's open. Let me in. Nothing. Yeah, something can spawn here for sure. Damn. So I guess okay. it's like alternate routes when you play each time. That's that cool make, though. That makes sense. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I guess I'll leave. Cool, man. To the developer, keep making games. This is fucking awesome. 
This is great. I'm about to die. Never mind, you turned around. Okay, we win. Nice. Yeah, that was really good, and I like that. It was nice and simple. I wish I could make games like this consistently. Mine are way too complicated. Because <laughs> you always just want to keep adding more and more, I'd imagine. Yeah, I just need to stop that. I mean, that shit happens, right? It's like often, you just want to keep adding more and more, and then you kind of get demotivated, and then the project never gets finished. Usually, yeah, I just trudge past it, even when it sucks, but with that one game I was making, that one time Shoe Thief, like, that shit ain't happening. Mm -hmm, yeah, I think it's called Feature Creep, because I think Mist Man 12 told me about it. Feature Creep, yeah. Yeah, like, when you keep thinking of ideas and just keep pumping them into your game. That's 1,000%. I, like, I, like I, I feel like I enjoy doing that when the game is done. Right, Because yeah. I'm like, okay, the game's perfect, it's finished, but maybe I can add this and then add that and add that. Because mm -hmm. at that point, in my mind, I know it's fine. Because the game's 100% done, I'm just improving it. Yeah, but when you're doing sense. it mid-development, that's when it really sucks. Yeah, that's that's actually what happened with Boofy's Bunker. Like, Boofy's Bunker originally wasn't anywhere close to as big as it is. Yeah. But then I kept thinking of shit. But yeah, that was old man. Great job, developer. That was pretty cool. I liked it. Yeah, man. That was pretty cool, dude. Like, keep making games.